Prince Philip has walked away from the Duke and Duchess of Sussex after the great shock of Megxit and his grandson's alien behaviour, a royal expert has claimed. The Duke of Edinburgh, 99, who gave up his naval career to support the Queen, 94, when she ascended the throne in 1952, was dismayed and deeply upset over Megxit, according to Ingrid Seward. Speaking with Vanity Fair's Katie Nicholl, she said Prince Philip quite liked Meghan, 39, initially but now compares her to Wallace Simpson, who triggered the abdication crisis when she married the then, King Edward VIII in 1937. Meanwhile, she said Prince Philip feels unable to comprehend why Prince Harry 36, would want to leave the firm, revealing, his grandson's behavior is completely alien to him, so not unnaturally the relationship has suffered. Ingrid, who has penned a new biographer Prince Philip revealed, said the Duke's once close relationship with his grandson has yet to recover after he announced he and Meghan would step back in January. She said the Duke could neither understand nor relate to Harry's decision to quit the royal family, and he was also deeply upset by the couple's choice. Meanwhile Ingrid also explained that he had been dismayed at the manner in which they'd chosen to announce their news. Although the Queen is head of state, Prince Philip is thought of as head of the family, with Ingrid suggesting the Duke was hurt his advice to the Sussexes over royal life fell on deaf ears. Ingrid went on to reveal that the Duke's eyesight is failing and he has become very hard of hearing in his old age. Yet, Prince Philip has kept busy during the months of lockdown by fishing, writing letters and reading. Meanwhile Ingrid also said, he also loves watching cooking programs. He loves Mary Berry. She added that the Duke continues to make a massive effort and wants to look his best for royal appearances, spending hours to slowly prepare. Ingrid revealed the prince will often get up as early as necessary to arrive on time, adding, he's a proud man, he doesn't want to be seen with a stick and would never consider a Zimmer frame. It comes weeks after Ingrid said Prince Philip is very, very disappointed by Meghan Markle's failure to support the monarchy and her husband. Speaking to Sky News, the royal biographer said the elderly prince couldn't understand why the former actress didn't follow his example when she married Prince Harry in May 2018. I think he's very, very disappointed because I think he feels he gave up his naval career in order to stand by the Queen and help the monarchy, she said. And why can't Meghan just give up her acting career? support her husband and support the monarchy. As he used to say to Diana, this is not a popularity contest, this is all of us working together. He just cannot understand why she couldn't support Harry and help him rather than wanting to have her voice. Ms. Stewart said Prince Philip didn't want to be a part of the talks about the Sussex's future outside of the monarchy, which were held at Sandringham in January. The Queen summoned Prince Charles and Prince William to the Norfolk estate for an emergency summit after Harry and Meghan announced their intention to go it alone and become financially independent. Miss Stewart went on to claim the Duke of Edinburgh doesn't wish to get involved anymore since Prince Harry and Meghan officially stepped back from the royal family in March this year. Of course, it irritates him hugely. And when they had the Sandringham summit, Prince Philip was seen leaving the house very swiftly before they all arrived, she observed. He simply doesn't want to get involved anymore.